Hello everybody, it's Evan, and today I'm going to review a movie from 2002, and that is Blade 2. Now the plot of this movie is where, after the first movie, Blade has now joined a team of mercenaries who stop vampires, and this there's a team of vampires called the Blood Pack, led by Reinhardt, played by Ron Perlman, who want to seek genocide on all humans, so Blade and his team have to stop all the vampires and save the day. I thought this was a really good sequel. Is it better than the first movie? No, but I still think this is a worthy sequel. This movie is directed by Guillermo del Toro, who directed Pacific Rim and Hellboy. And I think he's a pretty good director. I do really enjoy his uh, movies. He's definitely got a unique um, style, I should say, and it's really shown in this movie. He definitely... He kind of likes horror elements a little bit, and like monsters and such, and and the action scenes are all awesome. It's still very bloody, and it's great, and a lot of the blood effects, they definitely improve on from the first one, and Wesley Snipes is really good as Blade. He's awesome, and Ron Perlman was a really good villain. He's He's a, I like Ron Perlman. He's a really good actor, and he was funny enough. He was also in another Guillermo del Toro uh, comic book movie, Hellboy. So I guess they must be good friends in real life. And yeah, and the the soundtrack, like the first one's also really good. Like the all the techno music and all the action scenes, it's really good. It's definitely a fun movie. It's it's only like an hour and fifty six minutes. It's not long by superhero movie standards, but it's kind of like Deadpool, where a little short for a superhero movie, but it's not too short where to the point where it's rushed. So that's always good. And it was a worthy sequel. I think this is probably one of the most underrated Marvel movie sequels, and I definitely think it it's great. Definitely check this out if you left the first Blade, or if you like Guillermo del Toro movies, so, yeah, Blade 2, really good sequel, so, that's my review of Blade 2, see you next time.